If you're a youper, a pasty is a taste-tempting, savory meal you can hold in the palm of your hand. And if you're not a youper, well, it's pretty much the same thing. You just don't get to eat them as often. So to get our Flatlander hands on one, we headed west to marvelous Munising and found Muldoon's. If you're looking for a classic, traditional pasty, Donna Grahovic and Peggy Crommel and their league of extraordinary pasty preparers will totally take care of you. First things first, before we get started, I, one question, do you guys vent into the parking lot on purpose? Because when you drive by here, it's intoxicating. We didn't even have to get directions. We just could smell our way here. <laughs> it's great advertising. It was planned that way. It was planned. Sure. Now, for those of, who have never had a pasty before, what is a classic pasty? It's our beef traditional pasty, and it has ground beef in it with potatoes, onions, carrots, and rutabaga. A ruta what? Rutabaga, like a turnip. Rutabaga. What is a rutabaga? It's a root vegetable. Well, I know, but where do you do you grow them here? Where do you get them? Oh yeah, right out back. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't grow. I don't believe you. What's the what's the history of pasties? Where do they come from? They come from Cornwall, England. That's the original location, yeah. and the women there did. It's the same reason they're popular here is because they used to make them for their husbands when they would go into the mines over there. And when the immigrants came to the United States, that tradition followed suit. So exclusively is what we're hearing in the Upper Peninsula because the mining industry was so large here. These women brought that tradition with them and it's never left. So it's a portable meal you can put in your pocket. Easy. Awesome. Okay, well, let's make a pasty. How do you actually make a pasty? You start with the dough that was made the night before, so we're all ready to go today. Okay. They're already pre-measured. Yes. Roll in a little bit of flour. Okay, I can do that. And by the way, thanks for giving me a striped apron with a plaid shirt. I thought shirt. it matched very well, and you're a youper that way. You look like a youper. I am, eh? Yeah. Yeah, eh? I mean, yeah, yeah. Does this apron make my butt look big? Uh, no comment. No comment. <laughs> okay, so you roll in the dough. And then I just kind of flatten it on two sides. Okay. And then we have the dough roller. Oh, there's a dough roller? So I just put it in the dough roller. Top, 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 top. Nope, right here. OK, like that. <laughs> Slide it through. Oh, oh, Turn oh. it sideways. Oh. oh, I'm helping. Sorry. That's OK. Do it again? No, no, oh, no, no. Oh, Leave just, it there. OK. Maybe I should show you first. Yeah, well, <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> OK, you do it. <laughs> and then just kind of roll it back through here, and you kind of guide it through the bottom. Catching. Oh, OK. Now I can He's got There it. you okay, go. Now. So through once. OK. Turn it sideways. Yep. Through the bottom. Roll it back. Oh, yeah, just what, like that. What, did I do? what happened? You didn't guide it through. Oh, and guide it through. You okay. kind of have to, there we go. We'll try it one more time. Okay, so. I stink at it, too. Do you, do you seriously? Oh, yeah, I yeah. really do. That's why she's standing there looking, and we're doing the work. Now, if you haven't gathered by now, one of the main ingredients in Muldoon's pasties is fun. Heck, the fact that they let me in the kitchen is proof positive they have a real good sense of humor here. That's awesome. Look at oh, Tom's. Oh. It's beautiful. <laughs> there we go. Very nice. Go. Very nice. If that stays together in the oven, I'll be amazed. You're eating that one. <laughs> <laughs> Making pasties with Donna and Peggy was an absolute blast. And I did so well, they even promoted me to prep boy. At least I think it was a promotion. Hey, how am I doing? Right. Terrible. No. <laughs> That's a big carrot. So if you want to experience the original UP fast food, there's nothing faster than a portable pot pie you can pull out of your pocket. And trust me, at Muldoon's, just one of these tasty mounds of crust-covered meaty goodness, and you're set for a while. You'll also be set for a while on adventure when you visit the UP.